guys, welcome to today. We are headed out. We're headed out, out to get more stuff for Champ. It is cold out, you guys. It's awesome. There's a breeze and it's cool. Like, got a jacket on. Glorious. Anyway, welcome to today's video. We are T minus three days until we leave. Three days. And we are leaving in the morning because we bought a schooling ticket, which is so dumb. Why did we buy a schooling ticket when we can just go at 5 a.m. and ride in the rain? Schooling ticket costs $40. And that's We're probably, not going to get there at 5 a.m. Probably no, cheap. <laughs> We're getting there at 5 a.m. <laughs> Brandon said that at Champs, everybody gets up at the crack of dawn. We don't even show till 3 o'clock in the afternoon, which I think is great. But Brandon says everybody shows up at 5 a.m. and rides before the show. Everybody, even if you show at 3 p.m. So, are we doing that? I smell popcorn. We're not doing that. Let's, let's be real. Yeah, I told no. Brandon we would do that. No. We're not doing that because to ride at 5 a.m. would mean that we'd have to get up at 4 a.m., have breakfast, and go there. Like. We, we are going to be looking super rough at the horse show, you guys. Super rough, and it's going to have to be okay, but it's going to be fun. Like, we've never been to a sleepaway horse camp. I'm excited. Are you excited, horse Sam? Camp. Horse show. We've never been to a sleepaway horse show. We have been to it. Yeah, we've gone camping before, but not to a show. A sleepaway show. Yeah, I'm going to be chilling in the um, hotel. <laughs> Well, you guys are doing whatever you need to do. You think so? <laughs> yeah, because I am not making I money. will be getting up, going, and then that's when I have a cot in my the storage room. Yeah, Sam's so bringing a, a, a cot to sleep at Champs because that's what people do. Brandon says that they like party in their in their stall. Like so, like I said yesterday, we get a stall for the horse, and then we get a stall for the people and for all the stuff. And so. Brandon says they party in there, so we're going to be going to some parties at Champs, and we have a few friends there, and it's going to be a busy, crazy rod. Today we're headed out to go shopping because Brandon says we have to cover our stall. So, like I just said, their one stall will have one stall, and then beside it we'll have another stall, and we will keep all of our hay in there, all of our shavings in there, all of our tack in there, all of our blankets. We'll keep it in there during the day. Yeah. When we're there, we'll take it home with us at night because people steal. Yeah, and you're a knowledge person. Yeah, I trust. I trust, though. I'm a trusting girl. But anyways, we will take it home with us. All of our, like, tack and boots and stuff. We'll leave it. But we also will lock up our, our stall. But today, so Brandon said we have to cover it so that nobody can see inside of it. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to go get curtains today. Sam's going to order actual stall curtains. But we're going to today try and find curtains that will cover our stall and then make it look cute too. So let's go shopping. I love the color of that car. It is gorgeous. So cute. We love it. It's blue and white. So this is the store. It's brand new where we live. We've never seen it before. Watch the car. And we are looking for curtains. All right. Oh, it's like Value Village. It's just huge. Oh my goodness. It's so cool. Wow, you guys. Mm -hmm. All right, it is August, but we are already looking at Halloween costumes. Yeah. You should get it. Build it and solve it. Take it apart when you can't fix it. You should get it, Dad. All right, so these are our choices for curtains. And it's retro themed. So I think, I, I just want black. Actually, these are perfect. They're kind of retro and they're black. I love them. These are them. I'm gonna let leave them and let Sam choose and see what he likes. I'm not gonna lie, I also like red. Actually, I love the red. But our our banner has pink in it, and I just don't think pink is gonna go with red. But I love the red. They're nice too. All right, comment below. What would you get? Would you get the black with with polka dots? <gasps> Or oh, these silver ones are gorgeous. I think Brandon's doing silver too. And there's three panels. All right, three choices. Okay, so I picked three ones that I love. I'm gonna let you see what you love and we'll see if they're the same. All right, 
We're going with this one and this one. Wait, can I? So Paisley. Can I try? Can I? <laughs> yeah, you try. This one? I like the navy. Or this one. No, wait. Okay, take a minute to look at all of them. This one. I like this one. You like that one, Sam? Yeah. It's not long enough, but. Oh. I want to get this for Daisy for when we leave. Kind of retro. Okay, that was my first choice. I want to get this for Daisy for when we leave. Aww. Um, yeah, it should be longer, I guess. Always is. What about yeah. this one? Oh, yeah, that's long. Okay, so I like those. I love the navy gap, Sophie. If it was up to me, it would be navy. But the only problem with the navy is there's, I think, only one. I love the navy. A bunch of them. How much is this one? Okay, so buy like individual. I think so. Okay, I like okay these so I like those, but I love the red. I've seen nice because these are a nice cotton. Well, they go together. I'm gonna go back and keep. Okay, them or what about these? And there's a lot of them. So these have little brown things that you can. You don't think these have brown things? Yeah. Oh, okay. So there's these, but then over here. They match, don't they? Yeah, I'm not silver and they match the silver circle. Oh yeah, those are cute. That looks good together. And then I was thinking like we could get a couple of pillows that would go, that would match. But I don't know, what what do you think? Like, do you like the light or do you like the dark? Like, Unless think about our banner. We need Pink and gray and white is nice. Yeah, our banner won't match this stuff. All right, well, what do you think? But I still think we should get these. Do you like the silver shiny? I, I don't know. You'll have to take it out. Well, so what's our color theme going to be? What's our color anything to hide our stuff. Yeah, I like the gray. I like the silver. I need a lot of them because so Sam liked these. But these are short for sure. Or maybe not. And I do. I like these paisley too, but they don't match anything. And too much pattern it's with our banner. Retro. I know, but we're going to have a banner. So <laughs> like, I think this with the banner will look cute. And our colors are like red and blue, right? Okay, so um, are these all the same color? I think so. All right, this is what we're getting. And then not those enough. ones? Not these no, ones. all of them. But I don't think we need these ones. Well, they'll be good because this would be outlining it and then <gasps> two of those for That's the door. That's so good. Yeah. I like it. All right, let's see. Let's look at it together. So we got silver and this is blue. It's like a green yeah, or it kind of matches the thing yeah it's cute so I don't this know will be on the gonna... outside and then this will be on the inside do not know where sophie went there was a time when the girls never left her side at the store but now poof gone anyways um we're gonna like finish shopping here and buy some more stuff and then set up our stall at champs and maybe we'll do a live video of our stall set up that'd be fun you know what else I really want to buy maybe for Christmas this year I think it's this is what I want to buy the girls for Christmas I want to buy them like not this but I want to buy them like an actual tack trunk so if you guys have any brands of tack trunks that you love can you post the brands below so that I can like start shopping now for them I want to get it like customized and engraved and stuff I think that would be the best Christmas present so I found two Schleich like in the same bag, $3.99. Don't we have that one? I don't have this one, Gabby does. I have this one, Gabby doesn't. Oh, I remember that one, so cute. I might not get them. And then these I'm definitely gonna get. For her dog. And I want some of them too, they're cute. All right, so we're at uh, Value Village. These look way too small. Oh, look at the size. So we found wind rubber boots, which are super cute. All the cute boots are too small for us. So we hit up a yard sale, I have to show you this. This is a tent, okay? It's like a tent, it's $2,000. It's a tent, but it's like a nice canopy. It's a tent, oh yeah. Oh, how much is that? Oh, we might need to get that. So, and then you walk in and this is the tent. It's actually like a trailer. It's a small Sam trailer. Sam loves it. One. So does this fold into a couch too? Or folds into, oh. Yeah, that folds into a bed. That's okay. The table. All right. So there's the bed. And that's the bed. And is this it, is your living room. This is like your living room area. And kitchen. then it's got a kitchen over here. And then that's like chairs. Do you guys see how it's chairs? That's cool. Like that. Yeah, and this is, folds right into there. This is way cooler than a trailer like we have. That's so cool, Sam. Oh, and look. And then 
This is like the living room, and it's got that's yeah. so cool, cool oh, as heck. You got an outdoor here, you got a fort. Yeah, okay. and that turns into a bed too. And this is like a strong bed. That's so cool. All right, my pony be coming to meet me at the gate. I betcha. Look what I bought at the yard sale. It's a magical box. I'll show you what's in it. Shiny, so magical. Shiny, magical. Look at you know you're in a gifted horsewoman if you can bring your horse in and carry your coffee without spilling it. Well, it's closed. <gasps> Today we have to pack the tack trunk, and I have a list. Show. Oh, what's in here? Oh, all right, you guys, are you excited to see what I bought? The dogs are all excited. I bought. Oh, here comes Penny. A uh, razor. It has everything with it. My lazy girl. Penny just whacked me with her tail. Like so hard, it just like slapped right in my face. Anyways, I was bringing my horse in and Sam got, and I heard Sam tell Sophie to come back in the barn and help me with the gate. I'm like, what? What do you mean help me with the gate? I don't know how to handle the gate. <laughs> what the heck? It's kind of them though. So uh, my garden is being taken over by weeds now. Oh, a big frog. Look at that frog. I'm going to catch it. Sophie loves frogs. I love frogs, you guys. Oh, you think I can catch them? Don't go in there. Oh, let me catch you. Oh, almost. Okay. Only Laura would do this. Terrorize a frog. Oh. So the reason I didn't try to catch him is because it would make Sophie so happy to have a frog. To see a frog and I lost him. Man. Anyway, I tried. Anyways, I'm going to clean out this garden today. It's my goal. Finish the tomatoes. Whatever ones aren't ready or aren't big enough can just go in the garbage. But there are a lot of tomatoes still. Oh, and I have four pumpkins. I thought I only had three. I have a mom and a dad and a baby, and then I have another baby over here that's not completely green yet. And I don't know if his vine is still healthy. Ew, it's got bugs on it. Anyways, two babies and a mom and a dad. Okay, so when I was young, when I was young we had a cottage near where we are right now. Growing up we had a cottage here, and there was this well, not a well, it was a spring. There's a natural spring and everybody comes here. Like a lot of people come here to get water and we used to do it when we were growing up. We'd fill up like our water jugs. And we've never been here since, since I was like 14 maybe. And we see people filling up their water from this spring all the time, this natural spring all the time. And we've never done it, so we're doing it right now. Like we've never been down here, we've never seen it. We have like coffee cups. Oh, there's the spring. Oh, that's that would it? That take a while. All that just for this. That would take a while. I was expecting like an actual spring where people put their their jugs. Is there like a, oh, you can go down there maybe. This is what it is. <laughs> this is the free water. I don't know, it kind of looks. Can I try it? Yeah, it looks fresh. It's a fresh spring. Debbie's going down there. There's a fence and there's a hole in the fence. All right, here. Looks good. It does not. Oh, it does. What a waste. Like, don't they ever turn it off? It just runs? Oh, yeah. It just runs into the ground. All right, try it. It tastes like water. It's, it's healing. Like, healing. It's got healing powers. I feel healed. Give me I the water. I feel healed already. I feel healed. It's youthful. Mm, it just tastes like... <laughs> If that did not work. <laughs> do it again. Hold on. I feel healed. My what? Here's. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm healed now. <laughs> oh, I missed. I missed. No! I missed. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to lie. It's not that bad. I, know. <laughs> I missed it. Gabby, Gabby, Sam went. Was it cold, Sam? 
So every once in a while when you're at like a thrift store, you find something magical, something incredible, something so worth it. Oh, look. Sam wrote all the instructions for our horses. Ah, oh, dirty hands. Anyway, sometimes when you're at this thrift store, you come across something so amazing, so magical. I better go get more treats now that I realize I have a pocket. Yeah, that it makes you so excited for the future. And we did find that today. Like, and we did find something so magical that we are excited for the future today. I'm gonna show you guys and we get more treats. All right, you guys are gonna see it right now. I'm excited. I don't know if it's gonna work for, the, for Willow, and if it doesn't, then we're going to use it for the dogs. So I'll be prepared for magical dog tricks soon. Basically, we found a ginormous hula hoop that's soft and amazing. Hi, Pen. And we're going to see if uh, we can get Willow through it. Penny does not like it. No. Oh. Let's see, put on the... just won't fit. Well, why can't she duck? Yeah, we'll just put her body through, not her head. All right, so we're gonna leave Sophie here and we're gonna come back in 10 minutes. I'm gonna work in my garden. I'm trying to get it all cleaned up before we go. They're fine, they're not even bothering you. They don't want anything to do with you. This one's trying to eat my pocket. And we'll come back in 10 minutes and see what kind of trick Sophie can teach Willow. All right, so she's ready. She's ready, it's been like 20 minutes. Okay. Stay away, Daisy. Everybody stay away. Get away. So I think maybe this is what we're gonna do. Make this arena into like a fun. Come on, you did it earlier. Come on, Daisy. Oh, come on, Willow. Come on. Maybe we'll make this room into like an obstacle course thing for the fall. I think that'll be fun. Come on, Ruby. Yeah. Ruby. She had time to think about it. You! Gotta duck your head, silly. Oh, did you guys see it? She knew and she ducked her head, yeah! That's so fun, I love it and we're gonna work on this more and I'm gonna work on more things that I can buy, more things that I can buy and make this into like a fun obstacle course for the mares for the winter because we need to be doing some fun stuff. Penny's like, I will go through it. Okay, one more time. All right, we're trying. <laughs> yeah! Let me go through it. She's gonna run through it. Good girl. All right, we found Willow's thing. Look, this horse can go right through the loop. Watch this, Sam. Uh oh, trouble. Oh my gosh, she's in the way. She wants to go through it too. Say, get. <laughs> That's amazing. That is amazing. Don't you know that you